morning students dear students today we will learn another method of multiplication students we have learned multiplication with the help of currency notes with the help of boxes and we have also learned how to solve the sums of multiplication in the writing form now today we will learn another method of multiplication that is column method so let's start multiplication so let's start multiplication with column method students here we have 12 into 4 and we have split 12 into 10 plus 2 and dear students here we have two ones and we will multiply it by 4 and this is equal to 8 ones now we have 10 and we call it 1 tens and we will multiply it by 4 which is equal to 4 tens now we will solve it in the writing form students here we have 8 ones so we will write 8 at 1's place and we have 4 tens means 40 so 0 at yes 1's place and 4 at 10's place after adding these two we get yes 8 at 1's place and 4 at 10's place and we get the answer for our question 12 into 4 is equal to 48. Now we will solve 12 into 4 in this way also. Firstly we will write 12 and now we have to multiply this 12 by 4. So firstly at 1's place. Yes, we have 4 into 2 and this is equal to right 8. Now, at 10's place, we have 1 and 1 means 10 ones and after multiplication, we get 10 into 4 is equal to 40. So, dear students, now we will add these two. And after addition, we get 8 at 1's place and 4 at 10's place. So, we get answer for our question that is 12 into 4 is equal to 48. So, we have learned multiplication by various methods. And answer is same by all the methods that is 12 into 4 is equal to 48. Now question for pass. How many tens are there in 10 plus 2? A, 2, B, 10, C, 1, D, none of the above. Students, you know when we split 12 into 10 plus 2, we have 2 ones and 1 tens. So, answer for our question is option C, that is 1. In the homework, dear students, solve the sums given at page number 91 of your maths book. Thank you.